We have a battle submission from Used Food. Thank you so much, Used Food, for submitting your battles, a.k.a. Um, Hi, I'm Rico on YouTube if you want to check them out as well. We are going to be using Mag Mortar for the Great League, which is very, very interesting. We're also going to be using, what the hell is that? Um, Gastrodon. And uh, let's see here. A Whimsicott. Okay, so that is the full team. You see the IVs up in there? And well, which one are you using? This one? Okay, that's what we're using. All right, so let's get into the battles. We have Wigglytuff versus Gastrodon. So is this a good lead? Oh, I don't really know. They switched to Trevenant and now Magmartyr. It's time for you to show us why you're in this game. We're going to go for a Fire Punch. Do they have Thunderbolt? Wait, Fire Punch gets blocked. Yes, that is a Thunderbolt that for some reason Magmortar, you know how to learn, not too sure why. We're gonna be shielding the Shadow Ball because that would 100% take us out. We're gonna farm up to almost uh, uh, one and a half Fire Punches. One is gonna be getting the second final shield. And let's see, you're gonna get to another one. No, we cannot. We are gonna decide to shield so we can win Switch. I don't even know if a Fire Punch will KO. Oh, they catch the move on Wigglytuff, unfortunately. Even though I think Use Food did pause, um, still they're going to catch that. We're going to come in with Gastrodon and go straight for a Body Slam. This is a little bit tricky because uh, Trevenant can come in and just farm down this Gastrodon. And then it's going to be a little tricky for Whimsicott to beat it with the, with the sh Shadow Ball that's going to take it out. We're going to go for an Earth Power. Yes, we can land it, and this will not do as much damage. It is, uh, what is it, like resisted, right? I mean, you know what? That did, that did a little something, something. They are going to throw. I think the opponent could have formed down. These mud slaps weren't doing that much. Seed Bomb's going to be taking out Gastrodon. We're going to come in with Whimsicott and get an energy lead. Yes, we can farm it down. And now the last Pokemon is... Well, that's not great. Oh, we let an incinerate get through, which is not good. So now they're at two incinerates. Okay, I think we're going to have to. Oh, no. Oh, girl. Okay, so yikes. Disarming voice will be. Oh, they went for a shadow ball. I feel like disarming voice would have taken out. Can we get to a fire punch? Oh, we cannot. Unfortunately, we do lose the first game of the set. Oh, that, that was tricky. That was tricky. Oh, girl, what, what are you doing here? Going on notifications. Into the next match, we have Gastrodon versus Dragalgy. This is a good lead with the Mud Slap damages. That's going to be doing some damage as well with Earth Power. Body Slam, not too much. They're just going straight for an Aqua Tail so they can let this go. We are going to decide to shield the Aqua Tail. Okay, that's okay. To be fair, oh, uh, no. Whimsicott can deal with uh, with this. Damn, how you say your damn name? Gradual. Girl, I'm going to vomit. I can't even say the name. <laughs> Dragout. Girl, whatever. It's done. Uh, we're going to get into a body slam with a, what are you called? Ah, uh, crap. What's your bunny name called? What's it called? Diggers V. Going to go to another body slam. This is not going to do a lot of damage, but we are chipping this Diggers V. Oh, they just, why did you shield? For some reason, the opponent decides to shield. I'm not too sure why, but okay. Fire. Why did they go for a fire punch now? I thought, I guess they thought fire punch was going to KO, but we are water and ground. So that is double resistant. We're going to go now to Whimsicott, but they do have fire punch. So maybe we can catch the move. No, fire punch is not a, a, a scary move with a non-stab diggers bee. So we're going to let this go. Yeah, we can definitely survive too. We're going to go for a seed bomb. This will be getting the shield or maybe taking out the Diggers Bee. It does get the shield, the final shield. Can we get to another? Yes, we can get Seed Bomb on CMP tie. Let's see here. Will this take it out? Yes, it takes out the Diggers Bee. And the last Pokemon is an Azumarill. And they're going to... Magmartyr, you were not needed whatsoever. I mean, Thunderbolt would have been nice to, to KO maybe the, the Azumarill or get it half, uh, half health. But we'll never know. Into the next match, we have Gastrodon versus Muck. Fantastic lead for this Gastrodon. And they're going to decide to stay in for some reason. And now they're going to switch to, oh no, the opponent is double weak to Gastrodon. And if this is your best matchup, not great. We are going to undercharge, but they do decide to shield. I don't know how tanky Magmartyr is. Can you survive? Oh no, they do have Rock Slide access to that. So maybe they should shield. They go for a double iron bash, which is not the move you want to go. They can let this go. It's just going to be another double iron bash, which is fine. How much is it going to do? That did nothing. Lord, you might as well have you just healed him. Going to go for a fire punch. This will be taking out the Melmetal or getting a shield. They decide to let that go. 
And they're going to come in with maybe that muck again. Yes, they're going to come in with muck. Can we get to the Thunderbolt? Oh, we do, but... Uh, I don't know if they'll see in Pitar. We just didn't get there in time. So, oh, they go for an acid spray. That hurt. Don't you hate when you go for an a- they go for an acid spray and you shield it? Who girl? Mm, that just hurts my soul. Thunderbolt will be t- almost taking out the uh, muck. Let's see here. The last Pokemon is a Marowak. So, okay, this is interesting. Uh, Whimsicott can clean this up in the end, but that's okay. Bone Club is going to be doing eh, some decent damage. Going to go for an Earth Power. Let's see if the opponent decides to shield. They're going to decide to shield. Yes, they're most likely going to farm down. And now this is, uh, I think, okay for Whimsicott. Even if they, I don't think you'd even need to catch. One Seed Bomb will be taking out this Marowak. I don't know if it can learn anything that will hurt Whimsicott. I mean, you know, Rockside did something. But yeah, this uh, Seed Bomb will be taking out the Marowak. And that, my friends, is going to be a good game. Into the next matchup, we have Gastriodon versus. We've been getting some pretty good leads, so we're hoping for uh, we're hoping for another good lead here. Gastriodon versus. Girl, hurry up! Let's see here. Weezing another good lead. I mean, you're just catching all the good leads. They're going to decide to stay in and not move. Got it? Okay. Guess maybe they didn't realize. Um, you know, what was happening. Um, we're, This is just going to be a brutal swing, so they can let this go. Yeah, that, oh, no. Uh-oh, uh-oh. I think the opponent is lagging out. Well, what's going on here? They go for a Marowak, a shiny Marowak, I should say. Okay, a little flex, a little flex on you. Earth Power will be getting the shield. They're going to go straight into a Whimsicott after doing that. And uh, we've seen we've seen how much Rock Slide does, which is not too much. So they're going to go for, oh, they go for a Bone Club. Yeah, that's not going to do anything. They're going to go for a Seed Bomb. Good timing, too, by Use Food. And let's see here. Seed Bomb will be taking... Oh, I thought I was going to take it out, but no. But now we can just farm down. Let this go. And Moonblast the Weezing when it comes back in. So Bone Club, that's fine. Oh, and... Why did they come in with Machamp? Are they aware that we are half fairy? Okay, Seed Bomb's going to get shielded. Uh, once again, Magmortar, I don't think you're needed. Um, Wound Blast will obviously be taking out Machamp in every Machamp lineup in the Go Battle history. And yeah, you can, okay, Magmortar's going to come in just to show your face a little bit. And we're going to let this go. Or we're going to be a two shield flex. We're going to let this go. It's just going to be, oh my God, Magmortar, you weak son of a bitch. Lord have mercy. You were just there to be a, a, a little bit of a shield. And hey, we get a three out of five. Not bad. Collect all of them Stardust pieces. Into 11 now ranking. And to the next one, we have Gastrodon versus. We need a good lead. We need a good lead. Give us a poison type. That would be amazing. That's even great. I love this too. Okay, Stunkfist. This is fantastic lead. Mudslap damage is going to be doing super effective. They switch into a zoom roll. And we do have, oh, 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 oh. We have a little light. Oh, girl, the spinning. Oh, my God. We have a You're going to get a little, a little head shake in there with all the spinning. C-Bomb is going to be doing super effective damage. Of course, they have to shield. We can take an ice beam. We are going to shield one ice beam. But we can let one go. Oh, they go for play rough. So maybe they're play rough hydro pump. So a seed bomb is going to be coming through. Let's see if they decide to shield this one. They decide to shield, which is interesting. Oh, and they quit. Well, I feel like there was still some play there. They didn't know what was in the back. The back was Magmortar. You could have won. You could have won against Magmortar. And we'll never know. Okay, into the next match. That was weird. We have... Gastrodon versus Gavantula. So if this is, you know, some Gavantulas do run some energy ball. Unlikely, but that can still happen. They decide to switch into Wigglytuff. Um, we're going to go for an Earth Power before maybe switching. Let's see. Earth Power comes through. We're, oh, we're going to go to Magmartyr. Okay, I thought we are going to go to Whimsicott. We're going to go to Magmartyr. We're going to go for a Fire Punch. Let's see here. They're going to decide to sh- let it go. F- Damn, Fire Punch does some good damage. It is stab. Can you farm down? No, you cannot. You are going to have to shield Swift or even... Nah, I see when one... No, I think you could have let it go, but it's okay. We're going to shield. Let's see here. 
oh, they come in with a clawed sire. So, uh, yeah, unfortunately, this debuffed fire punch is just going to be tickling the, uh, the uh, whatchamacallit, clawed sire. We are going to switch into Gastrodon and almost get to the earth power. Are we going to shield? We are going to decide to shield. They do go for the earthquake, so that's a good shield. And now they're going to come in with Gavantula. We definitely have to time out these moves correctly so we don't get another Volt Switch to come through. Um, yeah, because that would suck. Let's see here. They're going to go for a lunge, or maybe they do have Energy Ball. They're going to go for a... It's going to be a lunge. Damn, that did more than I thought it was going to. But thankfully, the Volt Switches are resisted, so we can go for a Body Slam, survive all the damage, takes out the Gavantula, and now we have a Claude Sire. This is still tricky. Claude Sire can have access to, um, whatchamacallit, Sludge. We catch the move on Magmortar. Unfortunately, Magmortar, you are just a third shield. And they go, oh, they went for an Earthquake. Okay, so Seed Bomb will, I think, take out the Claude Sire. Yes, it does. And we're able to win that one in the game, in the end, thankfully. Uh, even, um, I mean, they did go for... Earthquake, so that would have been fine with Whimsicott. I'm not sure why they didn't go for Sludge or Stone Edge, but that is okay. That's a win. We'll take it. We'll take the win. Into the next match, we have Gastrodon versus Gastrodon. Okay, a little double whammy here. Um, hmm. Both running the same fast move, most likely. Actually, I think Gastrodon can learn Water Pulse, so maybe they're going... For Water Pulse, they tried to catch the move, but that did not work out. So now we have Magmortar versus Abomina Snow, and Fire Punch will be doing super effective damage. Double it. Weather Ball does nothing. They are going to be able to go to another wall, the Weather Ball. We can take this. So we're going to let this go. Yeah, we can take a few Weather Balls. Actually, we can only take one more if we're going down. So Fire Punch is going to come through, get the shield. We're going to go for another Fire Punch. Let's see what they want to do. They're going to double shield their Abomina Snow. So, oh, can we get to another Fire Punch? Oh, I think we have the shield. I think we have the shield. Yes, we are going to decide to shield. They might switch out. They Nope, they didn't switch out. So Fire Punch will be taking out the Abomina Snow in the end. And they're going to come back in with Gastrodon, obviously, to get some more energy. They come in with Gastrodon. Now we can just align it to our Whimsicott because they do not have anything that can take us out. And there's a Claude Sire in the back. So this Earth Power will be doing so much damage right in the booty. And now we can just go for, ooh, are we going to shield? Yeah, we're probably going to shield and go for a double body slam. Or we can, oh, they went for sludge. Okay, you know, a little bait. That's okay. We can just farm down and go for an Earth Power right away. We win CMP tie. And this Gastrodon will be taking out the other Gastrodon. Oh, never mind. It survived. Whoop. Oh, there you go. And one Mud Slap will be taking out the Gastrodon. And we're able to win that game. Into the next match we have. Also, what what league y'all doing? Is it uh, Great League? Because all leagues are back, right? So Master League, I don't do Master League. I ain't got no Pokemons for Master League. Um, either Great League or Ultra League. I've been doing Ultra League. Um, that is a Skarmory on my screen. Okay, Skarmory. Magmortar would love to see the Skarmory. But we are uh, fortunately lined up with... They go for Earth Power. Okay. Um, I don't know. I, I actually have no idea what the... Damn, you know what? That did something. I didn't think it was going to do anything. But it did a little something, something. So they're going to go for a... Is it going to be Brave Bird? No, they go for a Sky Attack. So I don't know if you want to go like spamming up Body Slam. But no, we're going to go for the Earth Power again. That's probably the right move set. I don't know. Earth Power will be getting the Skarmory into red. Can we get to a Body Slam? No, but they do throw their move. Oh, we're going to shield. This is interesting. Sorry, I burped. Um, got a little indigestion. They decide to come in with Swampert, which was a bad idea. Now, is this a Swampert that has Sludge? Does it have Sludge Wave? Let's see. Seed Bomb does get shielded. Oh, no, this is tricky. Does it have Sludge Wave? Does it have Sludge Wave? We're going to call they don't. And no, it is just going to be a Hydro Cannon. They do have another Hydro Cannon. We are going to let this go, right? Yep, we're going to let this go. It's just going to be a Hydro Cannon. We can farm up a little bit more energy or just go straight for the Seed Bomb. Take out this Swampert. Goodbye. They're going to come in with, oh, it's an Empoleon. We can just come straight in with Magmortar. I'm not sure why they switched out. There is no move to catch. We just got here. Going to go for a Fire Punch. And then if they shield, hopefully we can get to a Thunderbolt. Can we get to a Thunderbolt? 
Yes, we can! Finally, the first time seeing a Thunderbolt in this game. Taking out the Empoleon, and we're able to win that game with a three-ball flex. Into the next and final match, I think. We have Gastrodon versus... We've been getting some pretty good leads, so hopefully it's another good lead. We have Gastrodon versus Azumarill. Is this okay? I, oh, we're going to switch to Magmartyr, which I'm sure the opponent is confused as to why the hell we did that. But we're going to go for Thunderbolt, which they have no idea that this Pokemon can learn it. And they let it go. Boom. And now they come in with a uh, Dunspar. So we're going to go for a Thunderbolt once again. Doing some pretty good damage. Oh, it does half a Dunspar's life. They are going to get a good farm down, but I mean, we can just come in with Gastrodon and soak up all that energy. Or, yeah, I think Gastrodon might be the play. No, we're going to go in with Whimsicott. Hopefully they threw a uh, drill run thinking that Gastrodon's coming come in. No, they came, they went in for, what? Okay, so they, they knew the move was going on and they are, they're, they're not moving. Hello? Opponent. Oh, now we freeze. Oh, opponent. Hello? Girl? Yeah? H hello? I think they just decided to quit the game. Yeah, they decided to quit the game. Okay, well, we'll be able to see what the last Pokemon is. So that's going to be, that's going to be fun. Yeah, they quit the game. Which I never understand why, because, like, y'all can just, like, press the exit button and, and, and go on with, out to, with your day. I'm not sure why people do this. Makes no sense to me, but, hey, whatever you want to do. Last Pokemon is a jump up. I feel like there was some play here. They might have just logged out. I mean, uh, either lagged or I don't know, but there was some play up in here. They definitely could have won this one if they tried. Moonblast will be coming through. And yeah, that's going to be the end of this video. So thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much to Use Food for submitting their... Uh, Girl, just go for the Moonblast. What, what, what is this? The fairy wind down. Okay. All right. All right. There you go. And there you go. Uh, thank you so much for Use Food for submitting your battle to me. I appreciate it. If you want to do so as well, you can look into the description. All the details are down below. Congrats on the 5-0 win. And uh, yeah, send me your battle so I can uh, comment on them. And I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. Eat something, drink something, you deserve it. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.